Hi, I'm Cassandra Clare and I am really excited to tell you about Lady Midnight, the new book in the Shadowhunter Chronicles. So right now I'm going to tell you the first top 10 things that you should know before you start reading. This book was written over a period of about two years in Los Angeles, California, where it's set, and also in Mexico and in France. Number nine. This book focuses on Emma Carstairs and Julian Blackthorne, who you might remember from City of Heavenly Fire, where they were pretty significant characters who helped our heroes. Now they're grown up and they get their own story. Number eight. Uh, this book focuses on Emma and Julian, but they're part of a big family of shadow hunters and a network of shadow hunters, and we're absolutely going to see cameos from beloved characters from the Mortal Instruments, get to catch up with them and see what they're doing with their lives now that it's a few years later. Number seven, Lady Midnight might well be my favorite cover that we've ever done, and that's possibly because I'm biased, because it was my idea to have Emma underwater on the cover, but um, it's a key scene in the book in which Emma's under the ocean, and the cover artist actually did shoot a girl floating underwater, and the whole cover of the book is a real effect of this girl actually being underwater and the whole thing being shot underwater. It's not like digital trickery or anything, and I love it. Number six, we're going to meet a whole bunch of new downworlders. Uh, the downworlder world is even more rich and varied than we imagined, so we're going to meet kind of an interesting and different kind of downworlder in this book. Number five, the book is set in Los Angeles, which is where I grew up, and I've been very excited to write a book set there. And because the landscape is so different from any Shadowhunter book that we've read previously, we've got new weapons, new monsters, new ways of fighting, new downworlders, and we're going to meet um, at least two high warlocks. Number four, the first edition of Lady Midnight will include a story that revolves around the fact that two characters from the Mortal Instruments series are getting married. So we'll get to see their engagement party and we'll see all of the characters from Mortal Instruments and how they're reacting to the engagement and what's going on with them. So it's a great chance to check in with those characters. Number three, we're gonna find out why Parabatai can never fall in love. Number two, we're not just going to check in with characters from the Mortal Instruments, we're also going to get to see some of the characters from the Infernal Devices because, of course, they have an interest in the Blackthorns and the Carstairs. And number one, I'm going to tell you the last line of the book. It's, why lie, he said.